ahead of your Holloway, Halloween weekend, excuse me, we have a major health alert concerning one of Southwest Florida's most popular beaches. Stay away from Blind Pass Beach. It's the word from the health department tonight. Test samples taken this week revealing an unsafe amount of bacteria along the Sanibel Beach that's popular with waders and swimmers. Four in your corners, Malcolm Johnson joining us live from the coast tonight with more on what you need to know. Malcolm. That's right, guys. Life is pretty good right now. We've got the beach chair out, the sun. It's on its way down. If there's one thing I could do, it'd be getting the water for a swim, but I can't. Take a look at this sign right here. The Lee County Department of Health says there's too much bacteria in the water for anyone to get inside. As the water crashes along the shorelines of Sanibel's Blind Pass Beach, tourists from up north are compelled to capture the moment. To get away from the cold weather, it's 40 degrees up there right now. But just beyond the thin blades of grass lies a yellow and red advisory sign that couples from Wisconsin or Sanibel natives aren't used to seeing. Brought our dog out to have a little romp in the water, and now we're going to have to go to another beach. They'll have to go elsewhere because of the high levels of Enterococcus, a lactic acid bacteria found in the water, something the corks say they've never seen in their 16 years of living on the island. We came here on our honeymoon back in the 80s and we always wanted to move here after that. And if we would have come here on our honeymoon and saw this, we probably would have never moved here. Have ruined your experience out here? A little bit because I wanted to go in the water. I'm hesitant, really looking forward to swimming and seashelling and everything. Seashelling is still okay. Abalone, I was looking for abalone. And finding new shells by yourself or in groups won't be a problem. But holding on tight to your fishing rod and eating what's on the other end might not be the best idea. What do you think about all the people fishing out here? They're crazy. <laughs> because the, the, the fish is terminated, they can't eat that fish. And while the idea of catching dinner is dashed, there's nothing wrong with enjoying the view from the beach. I don't think there's much harm to it as long as you don't go out really up your neck or something like that. So guys, here's why you don't want to get in the water. You've got a higher chance of contracting what's called gastroenteritis. That comes with symptoms of vomiting, uh, throwing up, uh, huge stomach cramps, uh, diarrhea. I know I don't want any of that, and I'm sure a lot of our viewers at home don't either. But for now, reporting on Sanibel Island, Malcolm Johnson, Fox 4, in your corner. <laughs>